Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Lemmings World Tour. Today is the day that we officially cement our status as a legend among rock stars. Even though we really haven't played any music all this uh, level pack, I, I played a little harmonica, but I'm not that good at that. But apparently that's enough to be considered a legend, because even though we didn't play music, we have been playing music-related levels, and we just have two levels left in this rank. I'm confident we can get through both of them in this video, and you know what? If this video ends up being super long, so be it. We're finishing the rank today. And we are on level 39, I will always love lemmings. Well, I think that's a little bold of a statement for me to personally to say, because I've been moving away from lemmings over the last couple of years, but... Maybe Strato feels differently, and I definitely know there are some people who will always love lemmings. I will say, it'll always hold a special place in my heart. 60 lemmings, we can afford to kill up to one of them, and this is by Whitney Houston. Oh boy. And a 95 release rate. Three hatches, a lot of steel, and a nice looking dirt level. Let's go. Okay. Stacker, and only diagonal... Uh, only diagonal destructive skills. What the heck? How are, we, how are we gonna get for this? We're gonna have to like mine and then f and what? Oh no 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 we mine and block. Okay, I already see. So we're gonna need to save the blocker for this part, and we're gonna need to save the stacker for the end. Okay, that's two skills. Or we can or we can alternatively use another miner. I'm stupid. I'm like, how do we get through this fiend at the end? I just don't know. It's impossible. No, Artie, there are tons of miners. Okay, so we don't even necessarily need the blocker or the stacker. We need one, we need either or, blocker or stacker for the end, not necessarily both. All right. Miner. Miner. Okay, it looks like the miners are going to be the commodity here. These guys are trapped, and there's, there is no way we can get these guys out, so we're going to have to focus on this hatch first. Oh, also... Okay, well, they, they are facing to the left, which is good. So I can send a climber up this way. Okay, miners are a commodity. If, we can ever, if it's at all possible to use a fencer, we should. So in this case, we have to use a miner here. I think we can use we can use a fencer to get them out here. All right. Now the question is, blocker or stacker? First off, can we even use the stacker? Probably we can, because what we would do is we would build up here. Okay. I think that the blocker is going to be more powerful than the stacker, so I wanted to use the stacker there. All right. And I think if we build up there, I believe we can use a, a fencer to get them out. I believe. I believe we can. All right. If we do that, though, we only have five builders left. We can use one builder for the end here. We're going to need one builder to get them out up here. One builder, maybe two builders to get up over there. I'm gonna assume one, two, three. Hmm. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to experiment a little bit before I can make a full decision. Uh, okay. So I'm gonna start by building up here, and then building back, because we will need to get them back over that trap. So if we do that, I just want to see. Oh, no. I just realized that he'll climb over that stack. That's no good. Well, folks, it looks like we're going to be mining through that. So, actually, maybe we, should, maybe we can't use the stacker there. Oh, wait. We can... Mine and potentially then fence up if we have like two lemmings going down at the same time. If we free the upper crowd, we can mine and then have a lemming fence up without needing to waste a builder at the start. Now here's the question. Oh wait, no. So if we if we just send 
this guy to go back. I don't think he'll finish the stack in time. No, one lemming will escape. Well, folks, guess that means we're going to be sending two climbers up at the beginning. Which actually might be a bad thing, but yeah, that's actually bad. We can't do that because of this. Razzafrazzin traps. Okay. Where do we need miners? We absolutely need one for the end. No question about that. Maybe two. We either need one and the... No, we, we need two. I'm assuming we're going to need two for this part. And we also have a glider. I do need to remember, we do have a glider. I'm not sure what the glider will really be... Well, the glider will be useful for this part, I guess. Maybe the maybe a glider can go down? And then turn around and build? Maybe. Maybe. I'm not seeing a whole lot of use for the glider, though. Except maybe to glide... Maybe we can make the first lemming out a glider so he can get a, a, a head start on stacking. Nope, still one lemming who goes by. Alright, I like this level. This is trickier than it looks. I'm guessing all these one-way arrows were put in to seal back roots, which is good. As well as a lot of the steel, I'm guessing. I feel like... Okay, the, we have three fencers. Clearly, we're going to need a fencer to let them out. What about other fencers? Maybe a fencer to get people up here? But we, do, we don't really need anyone to go up there other than climbers, and everyone else just needs to go down. Maybe we can maybe we can fence this way and avoid using a miner there. That would be nice. And if that's the case, then we still have a fencer to spare somewhere. Hmm. Curiouser and curiouser. Now for the miners. We need one miner to get them out, no question. Two there, most likely, which leaves us with two. So maybe we mine and fence them out all... Maybe we can mi just mine under the trap and then fence them out. Yeah, you know what? Why overcomplicate things? Alright, I'm gonna try putting a blocker at the beginning. Here. Maybe that's wrong, but we're gonna try stuff. There's no use just sitting here doing nothing. Alright, I gotta try. Or I gotta check first. Okay, we can fence them out this way. That's good. Alright. We're gonna mine for here. I think we can spare the miner. Then we're gonna fence them out. Can we fence them out in such a way that I hit the steel? On the way up. But not not hit the steel like that. No, that's Bomber. Okay, so the lemmings will go up this way. Oh, I should... I should send a second climber. One defense through here and the other to go up. Okay. We're gonna have to multitask a little bit, and that's okay. You know what? Multitasking is important in lemmings, you know? One of the reasons why time limits can actually be essential. Alright. So unfortunately, I think we'll have to waste a builder to turn this guy around. Doggone it! We have to use two builders to get over there. Okay, so that's two. So that'll leave us with four. We need then that will be three, then two, and then one, and then zero. Okay, I think this will work. I think this will work. Alright. 
This is where it might get a little finicky. All right. Sure enough, we can have him glide there and only build a tiny bit. That sucks. Hmm, I don't like that. I also don't like how we might have to rely on the lemmings lining up just right for fencing through all of this. Yeesh. I feel like I wasted a builder there, but I can't prove it. Hmm. Oh, not to mention, if we have so many lemmings going down all at once, we actually really should try to save the builder for the end, so... or the blocker for the end. Legit, very tricky. I think I've at least got part of the solution correct. Perhaps... I don't like wasting miners, but... Let's see, we have three miners left at this point, and we only need two, so actually... We could just... Alright. Okay. We don't really need to be super efficient. I'm going to send two climbers at the beginning here. You will turn around. You're going to block here. You turn around, and then we're going to mine all of them down here. That'll combine these two hatches. Then we can just mine to get them out. Now here's a question. Interesting. Yeah, I like I like that. I like having him glide so that way we can build in this direction instead, and that'll stop anybody from uh, dying. Well, that'll stop a copious amount of people from dying. Now... <laughs> oh, whoops. Hey, buddy. Now we just have to hope that they, yeah, none of them are going to hit. You will mine for this. Alright, now as long... Wait, dug on it. I used the blocker in the wrong place again. I forgot. We're saving the blocker for the end, so... One, two. You go ahead. You're gonna hit a uh, stack there. Nope, you're gonna stack farther back than that. Just like that. 
Okay, I really like this level. I really like this level. Actually, no, I should, I should wait to fence until I, I get pretty low down just to give as much time for this guy to build that second bridge back as possible. Whoops. We should not have the we should not have that guy build until really late, because this guy has to be the one who mines down, otherwise he's gonna climb up over this and climb up over the stack and die. There you go. So the only tricky part of the level left, I think going to be mine plus mine, but then we can block and then build and then fence. So it should be pretty straightforward, I think? From here on out. Alright. Here we go. Boom. Mine plus mine. Oh, that and that was all of our miners. Now, I am hoping that there isn't going to be a huge clump of lemmings all at the end here. At the beginning. How many is that? That's... A lot. Oh, I forgot. You know what? I didn't even realize that was there, but... You know what? We have two builders left, so we can use one to get over here. Or actually, even better. I'll do you one better than that. We're going to build out, block, and then we can fence for this. I didn't even... I literally didn't even see that rock. All right. And we saved the climber. That looks like it was pretty much exactly as intended. We had an extra climber if we wanted to do that a little more efficiently. That was super fun. Really good level. Really good level. I super like that. Nice looking dirt level, great solution, and a good difficulty. That is a good last rank level, ladies and gentlemen. That took a bit of time to suss out, but I feel like most of it was just kind of figuring out which skills needed to go where, and then working out from that, and I really like that. It was a, not too much entropy on that level, but it was just, mmm, chef's kiss. Really like that. Great level to start out this last Legend vi video. Now, we only have one level in the Legend rank left. It's the final official level in the pack before we start the bonus ranks, and it is probably going to be a big one. It is level 40. The Time of My Life by Dirty Dancing. Oh yeah, it would be it would be one of these music tile set levels. It's just so fitting. We've got the amplifier, the electric guitar, some speakers, a disco ball, a piano, another guitar, a statue of a lemming, and some more music equipment. Ooh man. 80 lemmings, we can kill up to two of them. I hope we get a special track for the last level. That would be so cool. Interesting skill set. Nope, still the same old, same old. Okay. For me, the toughest part of this tile set is figuring out what is solid and what is not, and that's where true physics come in. Then there's a pixel sticking out there. No climbers. Interesting. So they're stuck down here. We could fence them out, potentially. This is a fairly restrictive skill set. Now, how are we going to get them out of this pickle? They are surrounded by steel. They have to go out this way. Presumably, we're going to dig and build, and then they're going to fence through all of that. And presumably, we're going to need to maybe build or stack to get up here. 
and bash. Okay, well, I see where the fencer is going to be used, and I see where one of the two diggers is going to be used. Hmm. This is actually... This is a really restrictive skill set for the level. Okay, well, I see at least an easy way to get these guys out. <laughs> Honestly, for me, the no climbers is going to be kind of the, t the tricky part. Also, getting these guys out. Presumably, this is where we're going to use the bombers. Yeah, I see that now. Bombers are going to be used there. Huh. Does that just... Okay, now no, they can still get up that. So they're all hemmed in there. We can use basically any destructive skill to get them out. I don't think... I think we're only... I think we can spare a basher somewhere. Okay, maybe this isn't going to be as hard as I thought. Okay. Definitely need a builder for here. And I think that's it. I'm trying to figure out a way to trap them in... Oh! Oh! Well, wait, and I know that won't work. I was like, what if we build a bridge here to trap them all here, and then we dig them out later? Actually, you know, that... Could... Work? Let's try it. Something tells me that builders are going to be kind of a commodity, but... Okay. But we can use platformers to get up here. Just like so. Now the problem is they're still here. Oh, but we can get them out with a basher. Ha-ha! <laughs> okay. You gotta admit, this is cool! <laughs> that, I love that. I hope that was intended. That was so good. Oh, wait. Shoot. We kinda needed to isolate a lemming. Yeah, we can platform across there. Okay. This is the last builder we can use. Because we need the final builder for up here. Yeah, so they should be able to get up there. But we need to isolate another lemming. Yeah, one, one more bomber will let him get up. That's I love that. That's really cool. Okay. We do... Actually, wait. The doy We can just platform to create a little holding area. Because I don't... We need to platform in such a way that it actually does create a holding area, though. Like so. Sweet. Because... Yes. I don't even think we'll need the stacker. That's how boss we are. Oh, wait. Yeah, okay, yeah. I was like, wait a minute. I don't really like doing that. Well, crud. We actually kind of need that platformer for here, don't we? Yeah, if we could platform there. Okay. Hmm. 
This is where we need the stacker, I guess. We work with what we got. Now please walk up there. Yes, he can just walk up there. Alrighty. This is where we're going to have to use some math, y'all. Alright. So the fencer goes... Up a little above... Two pixels above this yellow pixel here. Alright. Okay, you're gonna need to dig a little deeper. Okay, wait now. Dig at the very edge. Yes, they fence up for all that. Now we can have them bash through here to let them all out. Do we? Even, I don't even think we need the miner. I don't think we need the miner. Or the other digger. Oh man, this is a fun level. Oh my gosh, what a way to end. Now as long as my calculations are correct. So what we're going to do is we're going to send bombers. Yep, and then they walk up all... Oh my gosh! What a fantastic final level to this pack. I know there are still two ranks after this, but... The official rank ends with Legend, so... Holy cow. To the disco! That... That is basically everything... Oh no, do they splat? Oh no... No, you know what? We still have skills left, so we can cut that. Ha-ha! <laughs> We're not losing today! We even still have a miner left. <laughs> that, like I was trying to say, that is basically everything I love in a Lemmings level. That's the kind of level I really like, where it, it seems fairly open-ended, but there's some really cool... Not, I'm not even going to say tricks, but just cool things about the level, like bombing to get them up here. It's not really that much of an advanced trick, it's just something cool you can do. And again, it's just like, you've got all the pieces, it's just figuring out which which skill goes where, and you just create such an elegant puzzle. It is so fantastic. The crowd is cheering, everyone is giving standing ovations as you and your band, band lembers, I love it, take a deep bow in front of the ecstatic audience. After such a fantastic show, though, I doubt they are going to let you go without an encore. Well, folks, <laughs> that was the Legend Rank, and that was the main bulk of Lemmings World Tour. That was so good. Though, man, those last two ranks... Rockstar and Legend were great. I mean, there was there was the occasional stinker level, but they were few and far between. And I still think even the levels that I personally didn't like, most of them were just, they were fine. It was just, they weren't, they personally irked me in a variety of ways. But wow, those last two levels were so good. Really fun and the right level of challenging for an end game pack. And Strato has said multiple times that Lemmings World Tour is not supposed to be a super hard pack. It's kind of supposed to teach you some of the tricks in the earlier ranks, and then the later ranks aren't supposed to get like crazy hard like a lot of the other packs, which I appreciate. I am not smart enough to solve the really tough Lemmings packs, like Lemmings United or Nepster Lems, or insert pack name here. Alright, so that does it for the main difficulty ranks of Lemmings World Tour, but there are still two ranks left. The Encore rank, which I think is supposed to basically... I think on the Encore rank... So both of these are bonus ranks, the Encore and Groupie rank. Encore is apparently just filled with levels from Stratos' previous packs, such as Paralems and Lemix. And maybe there was another pack as well. And the, he basically says these levels are going to be just incredibly easy if you've already finished the, le the Legend rank. So we could probably plow through those. And then the Groupie rank is apparently a bunch of levels that were made in the style of other Lemmings Forums members. So 
I would be eager to see if there are actually a level, there's, if there's a level or two in this rank that is done in a style of my level creating. I'd also be interested to see what Strato thinks my style of creating levels is, because I don't really have one. I just make levels as they come, but that'll be an interesting rank, and apparently he's told me the last level of the groupie rank is, like, by far the longest level in the entire pack by design. I don't know what that means, so we might need an entire video just for that one level, but we'll have to wait and see. In the meantime, that's it for tonight. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I'm Colorful Artie. I hope to see you next time where we're starting the bonus ranks, and we'll probably get through a lot of levels next video, so look forward to that. Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day, and God bless.